When I'm in the studio painting a tree-based landscape like this, I'm often left with a predicament. The predicament is which actual technique should I use for blocking in the painting or, or completing the foliage? There's a few ways to think about this, but today I'm going to illustrate one which is called cutting in. What I'm doing right now is I'm mixing up a sky color on the palette. And what I'll do here is if you look closely, there are a few areas I left blank, the white canvas poking through. So first, I'm going to fill in those spots, but the important part with this technique is cutting in to the green kind of reddish brown that I've already put up all over. A lot of painters will actually just paint the entire sky where the trees are that kind of background green color. And then they'll just wait till that dries and come and cut in the blue sky. And it's a more abstract way to actually create those holes in the trees where the sky is poking through. So right now I'm moving in and I'm actually painting over dried paint the dried green there, and I'm just cutting in like a knife. See, look. You can shape a tree trunk just by doing this as well. See, watch this. By cutting in around it, I've now shaped a little branch right there. And you'll see painters that'll, that'll basically draw an, an entire tree this way. They'll underpaint it first and they'll cut in and they'll create the shape of the tree by cutting in with the blue. And one of the things that I like to do is take this and then I like to wait till this dries and I'll come in again. I'll, uh, I'll come in and I'll oil out the surface or spray it with a retouch varnish and then I'll cut back in with the green over the top of the blue. So I'm just cutting back in over and over on top of each other. And that's a great way to bring up that finish. Another approach is just to paint the blue sky first and then paint the tree on the top of it. But I have found that cutting in this way and then layering is a better approach. It's more realistic. <laughs> 